question 21. A solid sodium halide NaX is reacts with concentrated sulfuric acid. After reaction, the lowest oxidation state of sulfur in the product is positive 4. Uh, so this statement is telling you um, is form the SO2 because oxygen is uh, negative 4, sulfur is positive 4. So it means uh, this will be a redox reaction uh, between the this uh, H2SO4 and the NAX. So and uh, we are quite clear that it could be uh, NAX, it could be sodium bromide or sodium iodide. Uh, and we need to further identify uh, which uh, halogen is it later. Okay, but the, uh, the equation, if let's say now this is the uh, uh, sodium bromide, so sodium bromide with concentrated HSO4, uh, it will form the HBr, and the HBr will further react with the uh, H2SO4, and uh, redox reaction happen. The bromide here, it will oxidize to bromine, because it's from negative 1 to 0. Oxygens, uh, the sulfur in this uh, H2SO4 uh, initially is positive uh, 6. After reaction, it becomes positive 4, means it gets reduced. So this one is a redox reaction. Okay, now, uh, sec second statement here. Halogen uh, Y2. So this one is the, uh, we need to know uh, what is the Y, the halogen Y. Okay, it's uh, less volatile than halogen X2. Uh, this is a very important hint because it's telling us which one uh, it has a larger size. Because it's telling us that Y2, halogen Y2, is less volatile means uh, it has a stronger uh, intermolecular force. Uh, in this case, it's IDID. And therefore, we know that the halogen Y2 is larger than the halogen X2. So if we compare bromine and the iodine, and the iodine, so iodine the size is larger than the bromine, right? So now we are quite sure the uh, Y two is the iodine, and X two is a bromine. And uh, some of you might ask, why the X two it cannot be the chlorine? Uh, because when the uh, sodium chloride reacts with the HSO4, uh, yeah, it will form HCl and the NaHSO4. And this HCl will not further react with the concentrated HSO4. That's why it will not form the SO2 later. Okay, so we know that uh, the X2 it cannot be chlorine. If X2 is not chlorine, then it should be bromine. If the X2 is bromine, then the Y2 it must be iodine. So now we know that the halogen Y2 is the iodine and the NAX here must be the sodium bromide, NABR. So answer therefore is B. That's all. Thank you.